What's up everyone? Welcome to my YouTube channel. How are you doing? Today my YouTube channel we are going to be talking about the most anticipated TV show for this month. Bridgeting season 2 that just came out, the part 1. I will give a quick review about it and also I will give a quick recap about Vegetine season 1, season 2 and also Queen Charlotte the Vegetine story but before that if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel please do it to subscribe, like, comment and share this video don't also hesitate to click on the notification bell to get notified whenever I post a video thank you very much For those who haven't watched Bridgeting, what is Bridgeting all about? So basically, in the season one, we we get to know about the Bridgeting family. The Bridgeting family is consists of um, four four boys and four girls and a mother, Anthony, Benedict. Colin, Daphne, Eloise, Francesca, and the other, the two little children, the boy and the girl. The beginning of the, the, the season, like season one, we discovered that Daphne just came out and she became the, the diamond. Queen Charlotte shows her as the diamond. And now she is now eligible to, to search for a suitor that will marry her so season one was basically all about her yes and how she found love at the end with the duke of Eastern simon their match was so very beautiful and i loved it so much it's one of my best sheep in the visiting story in the season one we also get to find out that penal Penelope, she is Lady Wisterdon. If you don't know Lady Wisterdon, she is the she is the newscaster. She writes news for the town, and she, in, in case of any latest gossip, she is the first person to release it. She releases both secrets and everything. At the end of the season one, we discover that she was the. Um, she um penelope was lady wisdom apart from lady wisdom and simon and and daphne there were also other stuff in the season one like um penelope who had a crush on calling we could see that in season one and as well the Federton. the Federton family was consist of three guests penelope and her two sisters they were like the antagonists of this series although there was there was no major antagonist but the Federton family they were like the antagonists of the, of the series and then there was this lady who was living with the mrs thompson the final who was living with the Penelope's family, Ferdinand's family, and the father that she was pregnant. It was a whole lot. And I don't really want to give much about this story. But if you have watched it, you know what I'm talking about. And is it worth watching? Yes. Visiting season one is basically my favorite. And then we have Lady Danbury, who was a close friend to Queen Charlotte. It was just a beautiful season, especially the love between the Duke of Eastern and Daphne, Simon and Daphne. It was so romantic how they became friends and they had to, they didn't, they were not talking and I thought Daphne was going to marry the prince. It was, how would I put it, I don't know what it was, but it was really, really good. Now let's move on to season two. Now after Daphne married, in the end of season one, we discovered that she gave birth to a child, which wasn't, which at first the Simon didn't want a child. Yeah, but after everything, he had a son, a son. Then in season two, it was now time. It was now the. Because at first, season one was all about Daphne and Simon. And now, season two now is about Anthony. Anthony is now the Viscount of the Virgentine family because he is the first son. And now, he was looking for a wife. 
and always on the other hand, on the other hand, she's now eligible to look for suitors, although she wasn't really ready. But on the other hand, her siblings were forcing her to find a look for a suitor. That was just like other sub sub story in the season two but the main story was Anthony looking for a, a bride then she found a bride from the diamond of the city miss edwina edwina sham uh, miss edwina sharma but along the line she discovered he dis Anthony discovered that he wasn't in love with edwina sharma but rather he was in love with his, with her uh, elder sister kate at first kate was was really really mean to Anthony. yeah it was really really mean but all along it all leads to love and it was so so romantic i'm not a fan of romantic show but trust me visiting is a really beautiful story season two was also good although we found that it was we found that in the end that the uh, in the next season that they got married that is this new season two that anthony and kate got married so season two was actually beautiful we also did some subcast like eloise finding out that penelope was the was lady with sudan it was it was beautiful as well season two was okay but before i move on to season two that just came out let's talk about queen charlotte the vision things to we saw Queen Charlotte in season one, season two, and we saw how she is. She may form tough, but she's actually sweet-hearted. And also, the and we saw, we saw that George, season one and season two, he didn't really appear more, but the two times he appeared, he was like kind of crazy. But we didn't really know what happened to him. So I felt like the producer had to bring the Queen Charlotte, the Virginia story, to explain the old Queen Charlotte and the George story, which was a beautiful story. It also, now, the Queen Charlotte had two plots in two main plot and storyline in this, in the show, in the series. One was the early life of Charlotte, and the second plot was queen charlotte um after the second season during the, the break yeah the one of the uh, uh the daughter um his son's wife the senior son's wife died with the heir and now she is looking for heir to the throne because this 15 children none of them has has given birth to legitimately legitimately all of them, most of them had babies outside without marriage. So she didn't really have none, as with the 15 children, she didn't even have one hair. And so she was furious and she was talking, telling the children that they must find hair. They must go and marry. The daughter should go look for husband. Why the son should go look for a wife, which was crazy, but it was interesting. And the other hand was the early life of Charlotte when she came into the royal family she didn't know who george was and when she finally knew him a little bit saw that george was not giving him the was not giving him the same energy he had to find out that george had this bipolar disorder george was a little but was it a little bit george was having a melt a mental issue but with the help of charlotte she helped him through even though the mental illness continued and we saw it in visiting but with the help of her love because she was a according to the story she was the first black queen yeah so she helped joe she she nurtured him even when he was crazy and you know he had his way that he he can get to him which was a beautiful beautiful thing the story was beautiful and it ended really well apart from charlotte we also found a little more about lady danbury and the queen charlotte i had to know more about i had to see more about her own struggle how she struggled and it was actually beautiful at the end queen charlotte if i were to read season one 
season two and the queen charlotte i put queen charlotte first and i'll put the season one first and the season two the the, the season two third place yeah the season two we can't actually judge because this is just part one we haven't we don't know what is in store for us in vegetating season two now let's move on to the main reason for this video vegetating season two the part one guys we are, have been anticipating for this polling the penelope and collins relationship because it has been long due we know Pen penelope had a crush on collins but collins on the other hand sees sees her as just a friend because they have been friends for the longest but penelope had a really great crush on on Calling. It was even because of the crush and the love he had for calling. That is why he, he did that stuff to Mrs. to Miss Thompson, now Lady Crane. So this season was kind of rushed for me because the way they just flipped just because of keys. It started as Penelope. Now that El Eloise has no. Uh, secret and she find out in season two the ending of season two that colin said he will never ever cut her which made us so angry and she told and she said to herself that she's going to look for a that she's going to look for a husband this season she was prepared and colin on the other hand has accepted to help her look for a husband during the the search of the old one things got eaten when the whole, everybody now find out that that Colin is helping Penelope look for her husband. So she had to like say that to quote the mission and she had to look for the for her husband by herself. And then she found this Lord who was interested in her. When the Lord was a guy that was interested in nature, vegetables, the sky and all. He even told Penelope that he would love to marry her. He proposed. He was okay. He was about to even propose to Penelope, but he discovered that Penelope still had feelings for Collins, and Collins now had feelings for Penelope because of just a kiss. Like it was just a kiss. It was just a small kiss that turned Collins' head, and I was like, "Wow, I can't actually wait for." part two to see what will happen is penelope going to marry colin or she's going to she's going to meet the um lord i'm actually waiting i want to see what's going to happen so that will be all for this review i don't want to give spoilers i know i have dropped a little spoilers here and there but please please that will be all for today's video. Please get to subscribe, like, comment, and share this video. Thank you very much. See you on for visiting part two.